This is non-calculator question number six. College Board gives us a graph that is to scale, because it doesn't say not to scale, so it is to scale, with two parallel lines, or at least in their picture it's parallel, L and K. They give you two points on L, the X and Y intercepts. They give you the actual coordinates for one point on L, and they ask you for the X coordinate of the X intercept for, I'm sorry, for K. They give you the point zero, negative four, and they ask for the X coordinate at the X intercept given that these lines are parallel. The first thing I would do is, since this is to scale, and this distance is much less than the distance to k, choices a and b are wrong. We're just trying to figure out, is p equal to 8 or 10? Now let's find the slope of l. The slope for line l is y2 minus y1 which is 0 minus 2 over x2 minus x1, which is negative 5 minus 0. So that's negative 2 over negative 5 is 2 over 5. So the slope of line k is also 2 over 5 because the lines are parallel. So line k has the equation y equals mx plus b, where m is 2 fifths. And I want to find b. I have the y-intercept, and the y-coordinate of the y-intercept is b, so y equals, oh, I left out the x, y equals 2 fifths x plus b, so y equals 2 fifths x minus 4, and the y-value is 0 when the x-value is p. College Board wants us to solve for p, so let's add 4 to both sides. And that gives me just 4 on the left equals 2 fifths p. If I multiply both sides by 5, that gets rid of the fraction. I like getting rid of fractions. So 20 equals 2p. Divide both sides by 2, and I get 10 on the left. 20 over 2 is 10. 2 over 2 is 1, so I just have plain p by itself on the right. So the x-intercept of line k is positive 10, which is choice d. College Board always asks questions involving using the slope, so make sure you're comfortable with slope and come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.